Hello Cancer, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. This is your reading for the next three months. This is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. In this reading, Cancer will see what is your energy, what do you need to know for the next three months and what is the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with, you will be dealing with. I'll shuffle the cards, I'll lay them down and then we'll discuss the energy. I'll also pull out some oracle cards and we'll see what is the guidance that you need to know for the next three months, Cancer. So let's get started. Let's get started. <clears throat> All right. So I'm going to lay down the cards first. As far as your energy is concerned, we have Page of Cups. Regarding career and finances, the sun... Any other general messages, five of wands. As far as your love life is concerned, the energy of your ex, five of cups. Current interest, we have the judgment. Future interest, knight of wands. Bottom of the deck, we have lovers. We'll see what are the general messages. What is the general guidance you need right now? What is the advice you need right now? Right now or the, for the next three months? This is something we'll discuss at the, fa at the fag end. Make sure you watch the video till the end. All right. Cancer. If I have to talk about the zodiac signs, I see Gemini, Leo, Sagittarius. Yeah, Leo and Sagittarius are standing out very strong and also Pisces. If the sign pops up, all the better. Let's not remain fixed on the signs. Cancer, what is your energy and what you need to know for the next three months? Page of Cups. Page of Cups is telling me that you will have a, a very friendly approach uh, i mean probably in the past you had slight aggressive approach because you were goal oriented chasing goals and i want to do this i want to do that nothing wrong in that okay you had become a task master uh you achieved the goals but somewhere you also realize that the relationships that you were expected to build or you wanted to build overall relationships whether it is romantic relationship whether it is friendship whether it is any other relationship the relationships that you wanted to build in your life somewhere you did not or you could not build up so far because of your slight aggressive approach or because of the fact that you were task oriented task master and you're like hyperly focused towards your goals and getting things done and doing things with a lot of tremendous dedication and devotion and you had your set of clear priorities and those priorities were definitely uh, about your career goals, about your personality development. But then one factor which sort of has got highlighted about yourself, which you have also come to a realization that significant relationships are, are sort of lacking. Okay. And now you, you have sort of realized that if you want to build relationships in your life which are also equally important okay as much as work and money and personal priorities are important along with that relationships are also important and like i said not just romantic relationship all sorts of relationship friendships and romantic relationships and uh work related relationships and acquaintances and network 
you want to put efforts in that direction relationships and people are going to be important for you for the next 3 months so i feel like for some of you if your relationships were with your parents or with your family members were sort of strained okay you will put in efforts to streamline your relationships with your family members if someone was supposed to be forgiven you're going to forgive that person you will put in efforts to make friends in your life i see you taking a very warm approach okay a very warm and a very friendly approach uh like if one person is being nice to me i'm also going to be nice to them or i'm going to be nice to them okay first i'll be the one who will be nice to them so it's a very a very sensitive approach you are taking but at the same time very strategic as well you know what is it that you want you are the best uh i will say whether it is relationships whether it is any other damn goal career related goal you are a very strategic person in your life you know how to get things done and you are also pretty much flexible you are not a fixed sign cancer okay i think so you are mutable sign if i'm not wrong okay you are flexible with your approach and uh if you are if you know that you need to change your approach you are ready and open to do that and that's what i see in the next 3 months you're changing your approach you know that if i have to build relationships if i have to build people in my life i cannot take an aggressive approach i will have to take a softer and a warmer approach and with this approach i also feel like you are attracting romantic interest towards you a right kind of a romantic person towards you with page of cups okay for some of you i'm hearing that if you want to buy a home you're going to buy a home or you will start planning to buy a home in the next 3 months for some of you i feel like if your near and dear one say for example someone within the family say your sibling is in the need of money and if they come towards you for that you will be very much happy to give them what they need provided of course you are in that abundant condition which i see supposedly you are cancer okay so it is possible that you might lend some amount of money to your near and dear one or it can be vice versa as well if you are in need of the money someone somewhere out of the blue is going to pop up and they will offer you the money that you need okay and it is also likely that you will pay very you will start paying a close attention to yourself in the next 3 months okay somewhere you are getting a feeling like i did not pay enough attention to myself like when i say enough attention what do i mean is probably your uh your dressing probably the hair style you wanted to do okay maybe you always wanted to color your hair but say for example you grew up in a very uh, traditional household okay and where coloring a hair was considered as a taboo or something but you had that very strong feeling to do it but you did not do it despite like moving away from your parental home for career and for work etc you still did not color your hair i'm just giving you an example a hypothetical a hypothetical example okay you still did not color your hair because it was ingrained in your mind but now you're coming to a realization that i am an independent person no one needs to influence me for so long if i feel i need to do something let me do it and i should be doing it because that is my inherent long term wish you will start paying close attention to yourself maybe i need to, uh, to go to spas and do some facials and visit uh, uh, salons quite frequently i i probably am ignoring myself now i need to i i cannot and i should not be ignoring myself because if i'm not going to pamper myself who else will who else will take care of me okay 
so i see that kind of an approach you are going to pay a very close attention to yourself in the next 3 months it is also quite likely that you will change your dressing sense altogether there is something very different you will come up with you will and you will start loving your new dressing sense your uh, your new wardrobe you will start loving that i also see that you're going to cut your hair or you're going to do some hair color or you might go for some tattoo and piercings or something like that okay you are becoming more colorful you're bringing in more life by doing all these different things okay as far as your career and your finances are concerned i clearly see some good news coming towards you cancer and this good news will make you really happy something unexpected is happening i guess which uh, probably you had stopped expecting any kind of result in your favor and you had given up hopes on something but all of a sudden is going to go in your favor and that is going to bring so much of joy to you okay say for example uh, you have been expecting a promotion at in your organization since last two years but that promotion is not coming your way because of some filthy office politics okay and this year also you are like i don't think so it's going to come towards me anyways i don't think so you will be like you will have a stand where you probably have given up hopes related to something okay and all of a sudden your boss is announcing like uh cancer you wanted promotion right so here let's go for that we are promoting you to so and so designation okay so some good news related to your career is coming towards you maybe if you are running a business uh you were hoping to sign some uh, sort of a contract with a big organization but then all of a sudden you stopped hearing from them and you did lot of follow up with them but you did not get any, any kind of positive result and you eventually give gave up on that organization you fe- uh, you felt like that organization is not going to sign any con- kind of contract with you and all of a sudden after so many months they are coming back to you and they are coming back with the news like hey cancer we want to sign this long term contract with you for so and so amount of money and you will be like what <laughs> that's what i'm getting so something unexpected is happening and it's a good news it's a positive unexpected news that is coming towards you okay and of course you will see a boost in your finances because of this good news what else you need to know five of wands abstain yourself from unnecessary fights and arguments refrain stop yourself from engaging into certain fights and arguments which are of no use you will only see that your energy is getting drained more and more drained because you are a sensitive person okay and especially such kind of situations where the possibility of energy getting consumed too much is there over there say for example other people might consume like 10% of their energy in such arguments you consume like 50% of your energy okay the bottom line over here is in the next 3 months avoid any kind of arguments any kind of fights otherwise you will end up draining a lot of energy and you will feel like it's a vicious circle you're getting pulled more and more into that once you enter into it so don't enter only avoid fights avoid arguments avoid getting into such kind of situations once you step into it the you will get pulled more and more into it don't want that right let's talk about your love life we have five of cups your ex your ex is missing you okay ex is crying thinking about you is it a late realization i guess yes it's a very late realization okay but at least this person has realized something uh i do feel i think so this person moved on they were with someone else but this person was constantly comparing their new person and you 
and the realization was only becoming stronger and stronger that they made a mistake they made a mistake by dodging you by ghosting you and moving to someone else and now this person is regretting like anything and probably this person is hearing some good news about you and that is making them more sad like if i would have been with cancer i would have enjoyed that success energy with cancer i would have enjoyed that uh phase with cancer possibly even take credit from cancer for some for for their success or this person is realizing that you are moving on and that is disturbing them maybe this person was so used to to the fact that you were always there for them you were always looking out for them but now they have started realizing okay for some of you this person was an was an energy vampire this person was thriving on your energy maybe you might have felt energetically drained completely whenever you were with this person okay you might have experienced like you're falling sick and literally for no reason fever fever is there cold and cough is there or probably you're puking literally for no reasons that was because you were absorbing negative energy from this person and this person was draining you of your energy energy tanks this person was an energy vampire and now this person is hungry for the energy that they were getting from you and they are not getting this energy from anyone else so for some of you this person has a selfish reason to think about you and possibly to come back to you for some of you yes there is regret in this person's mind but i see no intention on your part to reconnect with this person cancer then we have uh, an existing connection if you are in a relationship with someone or if you are in a connection with someone uh, or if someone is interested in you sorry uh, let's talk about if someone is interested in you if someone is interested in you this person knows that you're too good for them and this person somewhere they want you to ignore other people who are interested in you and they want you to show interest in them okay this person has lot of interest in you but at the same time i also feel like this person has lot of ego and because of that ego they probably are not coming towards you and they want you to take you to come towards them okay for people who are already in a connection with someone for people who are already in a relationship with someone if something was bothersome in your romantic relationship if something was not going right in the romantic relationship whatever that reason was that is going to go away and your relationship will come back to normal if you guys experience certain fights and uh if you guys were hurting one another literally for no reason okay i see that whatever was the reason because of which this relationship was not moving in the desired direction that reason is going to go away and this relationship will balance will get restored in this relationship all over again this relationship is freeing itself from some sort of toxicity so it's a good news for people who are in a connection let's talk about about a new person coming towards you whoever this new person is this person is charging towards you and i do feel that they are coming towards you with really good intentions this might be a long distance connection and this person uh, they are very young looking 
and probably this person is going to be a fast talker i don't know why i got that but i heard that this person talks really fast and this person they have a very good physique okay and they do take care of their health to a large extent they are very cautious about uh, their diet and about their health they exercise regularly fitness is very important to this person uh, this person probably might be athletic in their looks and in their physique uh, this person is a very quick thinker very quick thinker uh, usually knight of wands a uh, kind of implies impulsive thinking but i don't i do, i'm not getting that i'm getting that this person is a quick thinker and the reason i told you that they are a quick thinker because they they have very healthy mind and body very healthy mind and body and this person has tremendous amount of energy so you will really enjoy bed time with this person they are coming across as very 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 passionate cancer and this is something you will be you will be craving sex from this person for hours and hours and hours you will be like please continue going on and on and on okay whether it's a man or a woman you will feel so aroused when you guys will be in the act okay and uh of course i do see that this person will put in some extraordinary efforts to make this connection work okay not that this connection will need extraordinary efforts but from from their end they will ensure that they are making you happy they are doing things to keep this connection running and sustained okay and uh, it's like the they will come towards you and they will swoop you off okay they will they will kind of steal you away from the rest of the world that's what i'm getting and you will not you will not not even realize like you have got stolen like you will really fall for this person very fast and they will of course indeed they will also fall for you and that's why they are stealing you away from the rest of the world so quickly so i do see that this is a strong connection okay it is just that it's happening real fast and with the lovers card i also feel i'm getting this lovers card energy is getting aligned with this knight of wands cancer okay they are very young looking so don't think that oh probably this is a, an immature person or this person might might as well be younger than you so please don't draw conclusions like oh probably this person is slightly immature and all that stuff no talk to them talk to them after talking to them after interacting with them you won't be able to stop yourself cancer okay let's see what are the messages that you need to know honor thyself okay respect yourself honor yourself respect your own feelings time for love fest love is happening cancer you have what it takes you have everything what it takes don't underestimate yourself there is a deeper reason for each of your questions seek it you have lot of questions and it's your job to seek answers to those questions give yourself much more credit okay if you're putting in the efforts give credit to yourself don't simply give away don't be so extra generous that you give away the credit of your own your own efforts to someone else you were born with that it quality you are unique and you know that cancer okay all right i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment down below the link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and this person okay all right this is your spread take care and have a great time cancer bye bye